Hi everyone, I'm Becky Schufel, Executive Director of Life in the Wildlands. And Life in the Wildlands purpose is to help inspire and show you great experiences of why you should pursue an outdoor career in public land management agencies such as the Forest Service or BLM or National Park Service. So uh, today I wanted to share uh, a great story of why I'm here I'm from Montana, here in Alaska. And uh, I took the train here from Anchorage and headed out to Spencer Glacier where I did uh, trail work about 16 years ago. So uh, get ready and I'll show you an amazing story of why I love to do this job. The only way to get out to Spencer Glacier is by train. So when I was doing trails, it was a logistical challenge, but it was an amazing experience to be able to just take the train out um, to the work site where we would spend eight days in a row um, just doing trail work and constructing that trail. So um, it's just the train ride itself is completely worth the trip and getting to do that for free was amazing. Um, an experience that I will never forget. So right now I am at Whistle Stop, Spencer Glacier. All of these buildings here that you see right now were not here 16 years ago when I first did my trail crew experience up in Alaska. So here I am hiking on the trail that I helped to construct about 16 years ago. Um, and our primary function was to clear the brush, um, running chainsaws and through a very thick alder. And I'll show you what that looks like right now. So if you can imagine that. As you can see here on each side of the trail, it's filled with alder, willow, and cottonwoods. Um, this was very thick in here when I was here trying to clear this out with chainsaws. So as you can see, that was definitely a very hard undertaking. Um, but what you get to see at the end of this trail is all worth all that hard work. <laughs> And what I love doing about this job so much and trails is that you get to construct or maintain trail that others can appreciate. It gives access to those that would not otherwise be able to access some really cool vista points. So next I'll show you the end of this trail at Spencer Glacier. So I am at Spencer Glacier right now, the viewpoint, um, focal point of the entire Whistle Stop uh, area here in Alaska. This is where the trails that I worked on uh, back in 2006 lead to, um, and it's just an amazing experience to see this place again because I had somehow lost all my pictures from that time, uh, but here it is. And now I get to uh, have the opportunity to interview uh, Riley Thomas, who is an outdoor uh, education specialist with the Forest Service here on the Chugach National Forest. Hi, I'm Riley Thomas, and I'm a forest ranger, a forest interpretive ranger with the Chugach National Forest here in Alaska. I pretty much bring out people or help narrate trips along either to glaciers like this or on boats as well, for example, on Portage Lake in Alaska. I also do Portage Glacier there, helping to, you know, bring basically nature to life in a sense. Primary succession is the first couple of steps, and that starts to find your friends lichen. And so those green, orange, and white on here, those are a bunch of different species of lichen. Lichen also have physical forms as well, not as flat. They're kind of all over, but they're really, really great. And they're known as pioneer species. I think I love to do this job. Um, pretty much just talking to people and, you know, bringing past experiences with nature into a whole new experience here in Alaska. I think Alaska is kind of unlike anywhere else in the world. And so, you know, helping people learn about it and also learn to appreciate it at the same time is really great. 
to come back to this area after 16 years of um, being a part of the initial implementation of trail work, um, it's been a, an amazing experience to see what it's become. And just, I feel so good that the work that I did is allowing people, uh, all tourists from all over the world come here to be able to experience places like this. Um, if it weren't for that trail crew project, um, these people wouldn't be able to come out here and see the beauty and wonder of Alaska and Spencer Glacier. For more stories about outdoor careers, subscribe to the Life in the Wildlands podcast where I will be interviewing outdoor professionals to discover exciting opportunities in outdoor careers, share professional experiences, discuss the hurdles to federal employment, and provide advice on how to overcome these challenges. And if you're interested in outdoor jobs and don't know where to start, or if you already are a federal employee with an outdoor career that's struggling to make it to the next level in your career development, Life in the Wildlands can help you on your journey check out our career counseling and federal resume development services at www.lifeinthewildlands.com or call 406-848-1660.